Kirk. It's grown increasingly humid this evening and the threat of showers is closing in on the mid Ohio Valley. Let's take a look at our radar satellite composite and although we see just clouds initially, the last frame shows already in McConnellsville and Morgan County. We have rain showers occurring nosing into Noble County and right behind it. We have some heavier cells. It looks like they'll be sinking down into the mid Ohio Valley as we go through the overnight. Most of those are going to be thunderstorms related as well. The Highmark West Virginia Sky Cam says we're at 65 right now, 84% relative humidity, pretty saturated. The winds are calm here and the, the pressure 29.73 and steady. So when we look for temperatures, we're looking at 68 in Columbus, 66 at Charleston. We're at 65. Athens has dropped to 64, but not much variation there and calm conditions have dominated. Now we do have one reading of 20 miles per hour from the south that's heavily influenced by the showers and the storms that are occurring there, uh, but we are expecting that it'll be calm until that rainfall arrives. We're looking at uh, the temperature change about nine degrees warmer for Parkersburg and Athens compared to last night at this same time. The most recent uh, radar echoes at this point, we're looking at uh, New Lexington and Clear Creek with the heavier downpours, nothing really in our immediate area. It certainly looks like as we go through uh, the radar satellite composite shows uh, the low pressure system over Michigan driving that impulse as it comes through. And as we take a look at future casts, it looks like those will be arriving in the next hour or so. Certainly as this line comes through by 2 a.m., we're going to see several rounds of rain. And it does look like that's going to push into uh, the mountains of West Virginia behind. We're looking at some scattered showers as well. At this point, uh, we're looking at a dry Friday evening. That'll be good setting up uh, the Multicultural Festival at City Park. As we get into Saturday, generally clear, and it looks like it'll be sunny as well as we get into uh, that day. So the allergy alert says pollen levels reduced by some of these downpours. We're going to see them in the medium category on Saturday. The forecast for tonight, though, storms developing overnight, 60 for the overnight low, not much less as we get into tomorrow, 74 for the high and morning scattered showers, maybe a rumble of thunder, but more likely they'll just be showers and scattered as we get into the afternoon. As we get into Saturday and Sunday, temperatures will be close to 80 degrees and then into the mid 80s by Sunday, so that'll be the hot day. Monday will also be hot but a 39% chance of showers. Tuesday and Wednesday look a little bit drier, still in the 80s, and we cool down with another round of showers, potentially on Thursday.